Do you like anime? Do you like Japanese inspired things? Do you like clothes? I'm sure you like to stay warm. Well, I got this stuff for you. Introducing Imori.com, a website that introduces anime and Japanese inspired styled clothing made in house. And you can use the code Uchi15 to save yourself 15% off of all these cool, dope hats, beanies, hoodies, t shirts, sweatpants, and way more where that came from. That's Uchi15 at checkout to save yourself 15%. Off your entire order at imori.com. What's up, everybody? <gasps> it's your boy Uchi, and uh, back again. Once again, how y'all doing today? Come on, guys. We are back again for yet another Tower of God um, reaction. We got episode 10, Beyond the Sadness. It's, it's been getting pretty real, I will say. A lot of different things happened, did a lot of different angles, as always. But, quick reminder, guys, please go ahead and like the video before we get started here because we would love to um, hit the 200 like goal as always that's always been the goal since episode one i'm trying to get all these videos to 200 likes so definitely um, please support by hitting that like button and then the, checking out the description as always to further support if you're looking to support we are almost done with tower of god we have uh was it three more episodes after this 11 12 13 and then that's it and then we should be just kind of transitioning right into the god of high school so with all that being said guys let's just get right Like Attack on Titan, Dragon Ball Super, Dr. Stone, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. Well, those are just a few of the several different hundreds of anime selections that you can watch for free with my trial code for Funimation Now. All you gotta do is click that link in the description below and check out Funimation Now for a free 14 day trial period to enjoy all of these anime and many, many more. That's Funimation Now by using the link in the description below. Oh, did he set that note up? It looked like he set that note up from last week's episode. Damn, Cole made this whole strategy up? Dude, this man's OD. The heck? Don't tell me Rack got turned into a kid. What? How the hell? I can see him being a very popular stuffed animal. Like a plushie? I can, I can already see the merchandise. <laughs> like he has a t-shirt and everything. When he's that small, he look like Aguman's uncle. What the heck? Rachel can't walk? Wow. He's gonna t he gonna, he's still gonna climb the tower. He's gonna take Rachel with him. What the heck? As long as it's what she wants, he's gonna follow her anywhere. Uh-oh. Someone's having a little bit of the bubbly. Wow. I forgot. She's crying because she abandoned him. Oh. Oh, she's being honest. I'm not the Rachel you loved anymore. Even though she just admitted that it was annoying how much he pestered her and followed her. You can abandon me too. What a very strange relationship they have. He said, no one can replace you. Damn, look, they're all drunk. Oh, wow. Hats is, uh, he's very touchy drunk, huh? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, she leaving? Oh, wow. Passing on the weapon as a send-off gift. Uh-oh. Coon's up to something else. He's always up to something. Oh, my, what? What the hell? Yo, okay, that's uh pretty crazy. Wait, I thought Kuhn was the one that set that uh that letter trap. Oh wow, this dude is short, or at least he's just really tall. Whoa, he said, "Prove to me that you're worthy of passing. Endure this for a minute." Oh whoa, oh my God. Oh Kuhn, what the hell are you up to, bro? He wants them to put Rachel in. He wants to take the administrator's test, bruh. He wants to be an administrator so that way he can oh, make sure that Rachel and Bam get through. That's pretty busted. Yep, the rules can change due to the administrator's will. Wow. Only an irregular can negotiate to take the test? Now Bam wants to do it? What the hell? Because he's an irregular. That's true. Boom. All right, now we're about to learn what an irregular is again. Who came here on their own and rather than people like them, like they were chosen. Great calamity strikes a tower whenever one of them appear. Wow, if they help Bam pass, they'll all take quicker routes to climb up to the tower. Okay. Kuhn said he wasn't going to offer him any more help because he's an irregular. Did he not know this? Oh, they were trying to persuade us to help Bam, but oh, I guess it was all an act anyway. Oh. 
Not one of those again. Yeah, nah, this was this was a pretty good episode. I tell you, every time, every episode that that happens, the story just gets crazier and crazier. Like, I, I don't really, I do not at all intend to sound like a broken record, but like, it is true though. The further you get, the crazier it gets. And like, the story takes turns that you never really expect to happen. Like, I didn't think any of this was gonna happen. Like, where they were gonna try to, like, become administrators now. Like, Kuhn, it was Kuhn's idea, and then only and then we learned that only irregulars can do it. And then, obviously, Bam reveals himself to be an irregular. Because I remember that. But I, I figured that Kuhn knew, but I guess he didn't. So now he's gonna have to, he's gonna have to fight. What was it was it the like was it the first big eel that he fought from episode one because they said we meet again that's the only other question I have about that but honestly I'm looking forward to episode 11 I just wish that they had previews of the next episode you know but I guess like I said in like one of the earlier reactions if you take away the previews that's more time for the anime to you know fit in more of the story itself so and of course aside from that we got to see some more interaction from Rachel and Bam which is kind of nice that they've they seem to have mended their relationship whatever that is bam being the kind of dude where we see that he's been following rachel and he's been so seemingly obsessed with her from what i can tell because he basically was the light in his darkness like she is the one that pretty much saved him he was she was her his miracle and um and ever since she was you know pretty much driven to reach the stars and you know climb the tower like that was her dream and she only saw him as something that would have gone in the way so she abandoned him that's pretty much the reason why she was not trying to confront him or trying to have any kind of interaction with him during these tests but now that they had that conversation bam is like pretty forgiving not gonna lie he, he did he was very surprised by her answer and even then bam pretty much he still accepted her and you know obviously he still cares about her a lot enough to be like so willing to want to continue to to climb the tower and uh, just ju because she still would want to do it like that's her overall goal so i mean it's 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 very wholesome i guess in a way and right now rachel is actually unable to continue with any of these tests because right now she can't even walk she's in a freaking wheelchair in that freaking professor x wheelchair looking thing and now he's about to freaking look it looks like he's about to take on that eel again i'm i, I could be wrong it could be just like a, a another big demon monster thing that he already encountered once before that i might have forgotten about but it does seem like it is that first one from episode one where he was able to essentially force his way into this whole testing scheme of things but yeah nonetheless tower of god is like i said he just keeps getting getting better and better next week episode 11 is gonna i'm pretty sure episode 11 is gonna be very very action-packed Considering that episode 10 was definitely more of a dialogue heavy, more of a story setting, story setup kind of episode. And uh, I, I still enjoyed it a lot. I, I enjoy episodes like this, especially like, you know, because again, you always have to have some kind of cool down when you have, you know, like anime or anything. Like you have to have, every time you have like a lot of action, there needs to be some kind of balance where things are kind of chill and a lot like things can then be explained and then you might get more questions that you'll have. They don't, you, you want answers for when everything's cool and calm and stuff like that. So it's really good. And again, like next week, I'm like I'm predicting that's going to be very action packed. So with that being said, guys, let me know what y'all thought. And don't forget, please, please, please like, share, subscribe. Hit me up on Twitter, all that good stuff. Join the Discord so you can continue to talk to me uh, more. I do have some uh, special things planned for the Discord, like community uh, movie nights and whatnot and other fun stuff that I'll be announcing pretty soon. So definitely join the Discord. Link will be in the description below. And most importantly, guys, make sure that you are taking care of yourselves. May the power protect you. Keep it locked loaded right here on Uji Games channel. Stay safe, stay clean, protect each other, and stay inside. I'll see y'all next time.